Okay, it has been about a year and a half since I started working out of the trailer, um, which was a huge improvement over working out of the back of my truck. But I feel that over the last year and a half, things have just gotten piled on top of each other. I'd really like to change the shelf setup and change the way some of my tools and parts are stored in here. And so I figure the best thing to do is to get it all unloaded, completely emptied out, get it cleaned out, maybe paint it, and uh, start over. So that's what we're starting with, and it ought to be interesting. Okay got everything primed last night so everything is primed even prime the floor because I have new flooring coming in it should be here tomorrow evening but wanted to get everything sealed up so about three coats of primer everywhere on the OSB should keep it sealed now begins painting the color for the walls sometimes you just got to make a big hole in the side of your trailer. <laughs> Man, that was scary. And why? Why do I put myself through this? Because I want air conditioning. That's why. Okay, here it is. Got solar plugs installed on the exterior. Got the air conditioning vent installed on the exterior. Actually put the ladder racks back on the trailer installed this ladder rack for outside the trailer because I just don't have room inside the trailer anymore. So here's what it looks like. Here's the new flooring. Everything's painted, organized, clean. Got some new boxes up here. All the tools over there. Cleaned up a lot of the wiring. There's the power station down there. I got both of my solar panels here. That's the permanent spot for the air conditioner. Of course, scooter. Bins here. Everything has a place now. I actually put up a wire rack for the pipe. All the shelves, all the bin space has been organized. Got rid of a lot of stuff that I didn't need. I found multiples of things that I didn't need to have multiples of. The uh, spare tires mounted to the to the rear wall now. Everything is organized. We'll see. We'll see how long it stays this way. But uh, kind of excited to have all my the dirty hand tools over here now. And of course, they have a, a kind of a drip place to contain the mud and the dirt. Um, but it always drove me nuts because I used to have all my hand tools along that back wall. So I'd track mud and dirt and everything to the back of the trailer. So this is what it looks like now. Um, we'll see. We'll see how it works. Got a new cart too. So, so that'll be good to pull behind the scooter. So this is, this is the new setup. Woo!